up, y'all? I said, what's up, y'all? Look at me when I'm talking to you, bro. Nah, I'm just messing with y'all, man. This your boy, Knockout Boxing 86 TV, and we in here. So check this out, bro. Before I get going on the video, smash my like button. Subscribe to the channel if you're new here. Share the video. Turn on your notifications and go follow me on Twitter at KO Boxing 86 TV. And if you got a breakdown or a prediction that you'd like me to do for you, please hit my email up, knockoutboxing86 at yahoo.com is the email address. And don't forget that I'm live Monday, Wednesday, and Thursday night at 7.30 p.m. Central Time. And you can also catch me live with the singing OG KQKC Boxing Network Sunday mornings, 9 a.m. Central Standard Time. And please, hit me up if you want to join the TKO Debate Series, man. We're booking debates every week, so y'all got to tune in for that. But let's... Let's go ahead and get to it. And let's go ahead and get it popping, bro. And today, I got to talk about Gary Antoine Russell, man. This shit slipping under the radar. But I got to bring this to y'all because I rock heavy with Gary Antoine Russell, man. I like that young man. I love the way he fight. I'm a huge fan of his. Um, but we got to criticize people where it's due. And I don't like what I heard from him. So... For those y'all don't know, this was going on. Brother Romero was getting a shot at a world championship at 140 pounds. Brother Romero about to fight Alberto Puello for Alberto Puello's Super WBA 140 pound title. A lot of people were upset because Gary Antoine Russell is on the card too. But Gary Antoine Russell is fighting, you know what I'm saying? Kent Cruz, bro. Kent Cruz coming out like one victory in his last three or four fights. You know, coming off of two back-to-back -back draws. In a row against Goku, Goku Kong, Go Go Go, Go Go Gadget Go, like he that who he been fighting, bro. And he getting in there with Gary Antoine Russell, and so people, you know, was rightfully, you know, trying to what, what's going on. People can't drive, bro. She just sitting there at a stoplight. Well, she was there first at the stop sign. She was there first, but anyway, bro. Gary Antoine Russell, man, was asked about Alberto Puello, and you know, basically like yo. You feel like you want a shot at that? At that world champion? And his comments just baffled me, bro. Like, I had to read what he said like five times. And I don't understand why he would say that. I don't understand why he would believe what he said. It was so much delusion in his comment that I had to make this video for y'all and I can't believe ain't nobody talking about this shit. And I, I rock heavy with Gary Antoine Russell. Rest in peace to my brother Batman, bro. Who was a huge contributor to our channel when we were first starting out. And, you know, he passed away uh, tragically. And that's our brother, bro. Like, I rock heavy with Batman. Rest in peace to, to Gary Antoine's father, the patriarch of the family. You know, they lost their father, man. Like, so, so I got a lot of love for, for what they got going on over there. And, and who they are, bro. But this was some bullshit. This man said about Alberto Puello and wanted a shot at him. He said, as a student of the game, and I'm paraphrasing, y'all can go watch this on my Twitter feed, bro. He said, as a student of the game, I posted it on my Twitter feed. He asked me, like, I was, bro, I did not like this shit. But anyway, he said, as a student of the game, I understand that we all playing for keeps. I'm like, all right, bet. Like, I, I get that. You a boxer. You can die in the ring. I understand that part. But then he said, when you think about stuff that's behind you, I have to worry about what's in front of me. And he is behind me, and I can't go backwards, basically. Like, saying that he on another level than Alberto Puello. That Alberto Puello... It's basically underneath him. And that he ain't worth the time of a Gary Antoine Russell. So immediately two things. If you don't give a fuck about fighting the champion, then bro, I'm not I'm not mad that you ain't getting the fight because it sounds like you don't want that shit anyway. Number two, you sound either like a both of them start with a D. You sound either delusional or you sound like a duck. You can pick. The delusion come in because how can Alberto Puello, who has proven more in the sport of boxing than you, who is one of the, you got Regis, you got Matias, you got Taylor, and you got Puello. 
He one of the four champions in your division. One of the four best fighters in your division. How is he beneath you? How is he not on your level, bro? I done missed my exit talking about Gary Antoine Russell. God damn. That's okay. Give me more time to make this video. How, bro? And then, how is he beneath you but Crick Cruz is worth your time? This the shit. This why I brought these fighters. They got to watch what they say with me. This is why... A lot of their fanboys don't like me when I start talking about these fighters. I'm a fanboy of no one. We, we, we tell the truth. We tell the truth no matter who it is. We're going we gonna to rock. We're going to tell you what's right, tell you what's wrong. And we don't do narratives and shit over here. We just speak our truth on this channel. So, my brothers and sisters from the DMV that ride hard with Gary Antoine Russell. People that watch the channel that ride hard with Gary Antoine Russell. How is Alberto Pueyo beneath him? As one of the four best fighters in his weight class as a champion. But Ken Cruz is on his level and worth his time to fight. That's some delusional shit, man. That doesn't make any sense to anyone with a brain, bro. That doesn't make any sense to anyone with any logical common sense. And I was like, yo, how he on the card? With Alberto Pueyo and they giving Roley the shot. This some bullshit. If anything, Roley should be fighting Kent Cruz. Roley should be fighting Kent Cruz. And Gary Antoine Russell should be getting the title shot. Come to find out, I'm saying that shit. And Gary Antoine Russell don't even want the shot. So I ain't finna fight for you if you don't want the shit. Hell, I'ma fight for some shit that you don't want yourself. Nah, bro. I can't care about your career more than you. So that's where the delusion come in. Like... That's real, that's real shit. That's like Abdullah Mason being like, yeah, Devin Haney beneath me. Hey, Abdullah Mason, you want to fight Devin Haney one day as a champion? Nah, man, look, sometimes, man, you know, you got to understand when you pass somebody. And when you pass somebody, why would you look behind you? People going to be looking at Abdullah Mason like, bro, what the hell are you talking about? What do you mean, bro? We don't understand that shit. Hey, yo, Tiger Johnson. Hey, Tiger. Hey, bro, you want to get in the ring with, uh, you want to get in the ring with Regis Progray? Hey, man, you know, when you're playing for keeps in this sport, and you study the game, you got to understand. You got to understand that certain things, when you get past a certain person, past a certain level, you got to understand that certain things are, are behind you. So there's no point in looking back. Like, but Reed is a champion, though, Tiger. What you talking about? You see, like, bro, this shit just sound dumb, dog. Gary Antoine Russell sound delusional saying that shit. Then the other side of it is you also sound like you don't want no smoke. Huh? You also sound like you ducking that fade, bro. We can't have that. We can't advocate for ducking Gary Antoine no matter how much we like you. You can't say that. You can't say that that man ain't on your level when he done proven more than you. And you can't say that you don't want to fight when he a champion. Are you trying to get a vacant belt? Are you picking and choosing? What you waiting on, Gary Antoine? So please, bro. Stop saying shit that don't make no sense to us. Because we're going to call you out on it and we're going to have questions about it. But y'all let me know what y'all think of these comments from Gary Antoine Russell. He say Alberto Pueyo is behind him and he's just looking forward. And he don't need to go backwards because Alberto Pueyo ain't on his level. But last I checked, Gary Antoine Russell is a damn prospect. He's a prospect. I don't know what world we living in. Where prospects can say the champions are not on their level and underneath them and behind them. Just food for thought. Y'all let me know what y'all think. Comment down below, smash the like button, subscribe to the channel, share the video, turn on your notifications, and go follow me on Twitter at KOBoxing86TV. Appreciate everybody watching. Enjoy the rest of your day. And with that, we out of here. Peace out, y'all.